My dear aunt is fighting the good fight. So she shall have our full cooperation. And she is glad for our support indeed. And we will personally... What did you... Ooh, you're a master seducer. Oh man, attraction opinion plus 50. I'm not entirely sure how attraction opinion scales. But I can imagine... It scales interestingly well. So who are we fighting? Okay, we're fighting for this. So this is where we shall go. Send our army. Doubling her military power. Or should we go engage the enemy directly as they sit at her shores? I think we shall go engage the enemy directly as they try to siege the holy lands of my dear aunt. Ugh, go away. You don't get to decide on these things. My council seemingly has not learned yet what absolute rule means. It means no whining about my decision. As they are mine and in their nature absolute. Ugh, people. Honestly. But we're moving through a little bit of attrition area and it's it's going to be harsh i'm not going to lie it's going to hurt us it has indeed hurt us quite a bit he's moving his armies together in an effort to do something right we'll send more missionaries to pomerania All right, we lose a bit of gold for sending those missionaries, apparently. But right, we have to fight quick here. Before they consolidate their forces. But I think it's worthwhile pointing out that this is what happens later in the game between feudal and tribal. Not even a contest at this point, we're just slaughtering them. Gotta help up here. Next thing, right after this battle. Help those rebels. Oh, we barely arrived in time. But we broke them. Eventually we broke them. And they resolve. So now we go seek to siege them, where they stand. Oh, no, no, no. We'll defend against them. They're going to come north again. And they might be locked in as we arrive. So we're going to siege them actually in the mountains here. And if they want to do something about it, they're welcome to try. Could we... Get a holy order for once? Yes! Ooh, lovely. We could get a holy order. Come on, let's get a holy order. I've never hired one of these. Never gotten a chance. So the monthly cost is 19 gold. These guys we can afford. And it costs us 137 piety. I read somewhere, I think it was a loading screen, where it said that if you're defending against someone who is a heretic, and you don't have to pay them. We'll see. Yep, we have to pay them. Right, so where did they raise? Probably in our homestead. Yes, indeed. Let's get some ships up. Oh yeah, that's... That's plenty ship. Just to bolster our ranks a bit. Always wanted to have some Holy Order fight. My wars. That's so cool. A mechanic I have never used. Alright, we'll send them down over here to join up with our troops. Our dear aunt is doing okay. 
They're currently sieging something that is not part of our aunt's realm. Because they are in rebellion? No, they're not rebels. The Venetians are fighting to conquer this. But they're fighting a two-front war, and that's what's going on. Don't worry, dear aunt. We shall take the holdings that are you just do. And keep them from taking yours. This is also something I really like about Crusader Kings. It don't have to necessarily be everywhere all the time. While I do this, it doesn't matter what's going on up here. It really doesn't matter. There's nothing going to happen that I don't get wind of quickly enough to intervene. Well, that's really nice. Oh, hello there. You get to be on this flank. Congratulations on your promotion. Oh no, my Chancellor. Ah. What if I order him to take the vows? Ah, uh, he'll have to burn. Shame about that. Let's get someone halfway okay. This guy. Ah, the Holy Order has arrived. Just in time. Oh, I think it's time to redeem ourselves. Because we already have the bad option. We are just going to lose a building. But we might get the good option this time, so... Let's stop it. For real this... <laughs> God damn it. Didn't work. Right. Okay. You're defending. We shall join you indeed. Do we still have our siege guy around? Mr. Architect? Yes, he survived. Lovely. Oh, no, 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 no. That's the wrong guy. Get me my flanker back. So is the Holy Order now free? No. What are you fighting about? In Pomeranian Holy War for Livonia. Okay, you're attacking. And you're losing that attack. Amazing. First we help our aunt though. We finish what we start. You might not have managed this without us. Even with us, it's, it's questionable if this will turn out well. Are you still sieging there? Yes you are. Not done yet. Let's look at this holy order in our employ. Aren't they magnificent? The Templar Cross. Ah. Lovely. Our fleet over here. He shall have more priests. We'll send all the priests. And he still takes some money. Guess it's only fair. Ooh, yes. Allow the kitten to follow us home. That's always been a good omen. 
be achieving victory after victory in sieging what needs sieged. They are doing their best to stop us. Now let's leave our forces here. So he has no chance but to attack into the mountains. Either way, if he wants us gone, he has to come for us. We want to fight him in a defensive war. Or battle, rather. Let's put these troops here. Because we can easily reinforce. Uh, the Pope's upset. I rule in my realm. Okay, so we're locked in. And this is planes. It doesn't look like planes, but it's planes. So we'll have to reinforce. With as best people we can. 13, 11... So this guy. Let's hope these brave defenders will join us quickly enough. Turn the tide of battle. Ooh, this might not work out in our favor. This is not looking good. Should have stuck to my plan. Oh. Yeah, no. <laughs> I forgot for a second which side I was. Duke of Cornwall. He's an apostate. Well, let's burn him then. Right, we'll have to gather our troops again. Put them back together after this crushing defeat we've suffered. Our aunt has decided to come back on land. And the enemy is just resieging everything with brute force. Where did our aunt go? No one knows. There she is. Okay, we need to help. She's stuck fighting this battle. Oh no. We might not be quick enough to reinforce to help this. We're not going to reach in time. Well, we might have, but... We're not. So let's see, maybe he attacks us in the mountains, then we have a chance against this. Just siege it all back. Come on, dear aunt. Do sensible things with your army, please. She's gathering here, so... She'll at least be in a position to reinforce me. Which I believe she's doing as well. She's kind of back and forth thing over there. Steward. Okay. That would be our Viceroy of France. Why are you malcontent, man? Don't be like that. Ooh, they're attacking us. Ay, ay, ay. And our aunt is moving away. We will not be able to flee this. We will arrive 17th. They will arrive on the 6th. So we will have to stand and fight. Ah. No one for mountainous terrain, is there? Maybe our aunt turns around in time. But I have my doubts on this one. Nope. Psh. Completely ignores us, just as we ignored her before. Oh, we're breaking one flank. No. But we almost broke one flank. Now you come back. I think we should just go ahead and attach to her. This is not looking good. Our own forays lead nowhere. She just does whatever she does without any concern. Okay, we're touching. Put someone else over here. So she has a larger army now that she controls her movement of. But once we were the AI, not doing 
the person we're trying to help any favors. Let's bring some more troops in. Do you have troops by now? Yeah. All 900 is 900. With the current power balance, that's not even too bad. So we'll take these. We can go ahead and walk to the shore already. Oh, she's going for it. She's just sieging the hell out of everything. She means business now. Might be able to reinforce. This is going to be a dance of the stupid. I feel. We just siege, they siege. They siege back, we siege back. Where are you going? Let's hope we're going to go the wrong right way here. All the sieges. I will just combine our armies. We have diarrhea. I mean, you can expect these things to happen on the battlefield. Ah, our court physician wasn't helpful. Where are you going, woman? Are you not pressing advantage? Now she's fighting some raiders. Why do you care about raiders? To get another holy order in this. Oh no, we have dysentery. That's very suboptimal. Oh, let's go for something less risky. Something. Oh, very good. Lucky, a successful treatment. The set of the dysentery. We could go ahead and hire us another. Let's get the knights over here. The holy order shall do their holy order orders. Just need the number advantage again. Not just about that, but it surely helps. Oh no. King Jaroslav the Giant has died. He was murdered. That's a high, honest to God shame. What's happening to Pomerania now? Who's Lord? Him. Well, he's still Catholic, so... And he's attractive. All of that's good. Wait for our fleet to arrive. What, I'm sorry, clicking through everything. I generally slow down things. Am I not leading my army? Oh, yeah, I am. And they're doing the dance of the indecisive again. Let's get that holy order on the ship. They shall go. And fight for the cross. Oh yeah, a battle is being forced. Let's see what happens. Oh, this works out. Not well. Well, our aunt is doing good. 
We shall not become slothful. We'd rather take the chance of being stressed. Why are we not leading anything? We don't have our own flank in this. We're an emperor. Well, handing over the rudder didn't help either. I think we actually have to raise our armies. I actually really raise our armies. Ay, ay, ay. Right. Were you fighting? We're fighting. Someone over Burgundy within our realm. Okay, people. Time to rise again. Rise and shine, boys. Ah. You get to stand down, and you get to stand down. Don't have enough ships to get on. Can just stay there. there so I don't mix you with my threat news are we unmarried oh we can be married now right I remember we, we wanted the genius wife Was far too young at us uh, for us at that point. We lose a bit of prestige for that. Fine. Where? Oh, fine. We'll make a trip down there first. Little impromptu holiday. Let's take care of this first. And then take care of this little war our aunt is in. I'll be damned if I have sent, sent my own troops. Damned indeed. Like, actually, my own own troops. This is what happens if you're... Hubris is stronger than anything else. Oh, look. Maybe he'll take care of it. Before our troops arrive. Oh, he's trying. Certainly trying. What are you doing? Let's land our troops. Take care of this. Let's land these as well. Act them up. Let's put our siege guy in charge. If he still lives, that is. Does not look like that is the case. Right, our army shall be led by us and us alone. Is there a county where we can cross to? Yeah. Let's not cross from a river too. We don't have to make it worse than it needs to be. Now we don't want to... Humble, is that good? No. 
Fine, let's give over this relic for these priests. Yes, yes. Very good. We have survived dysentery. Our army was successful as well. So now let's find even more success in Italy. That's what you get for overestimating your capabilities. I deserve all of this. Absolutely do. Let's swap out these ships because they have been out for a really long time. All of this is planes. Let's go and just re-siege this. Maybe it attacks us. Oh, my doubts. What is this? Mountains. We don't want to attack him there. Definitely not. Let's unlink our army and have a dual siege going. We don't attrition with our aunt over there. These ships we stand down. They have fought gallantly for us long enough. Alright. New people need to be put into places and stuff. Uh, you kind of sort of don't like us. Give it to people who kind of sort of don't really like us. Oh yeah. Strong Empress. Lovely court tutor. Would you look at that? They suddenly gained plenty more troops. Man, this is dragging out. I thought this was going to be a quick campaign. The hubris of this man. 